listen, listen to this. Since its introduction in the U.S. in 1981, IVF and other similar techniques have resulted in more than 200,000 babies. That, that is amazing. I cannot believe we didn't look into this before. Uh, check this out before. Any embryos you don't use in your first IVF attempt can be frozen for later use. This will save you money if you undergo IVF a second or third time. It's, that's excellent because money is definitely a factor and we know we want to have more than one. Well, if you still have any leftover embryos, you can donate them to another infertile couple. How cool is that? Hey, you're still here. Hey, hey. what's going on? What are you doing? What's with the laptops? Oh, <laughs> well, we were just doing some research on some IVF stuff. You wouldn't believe the information that we found. Really? I can't wait to hear about it. Well, how was the spa? Actually, I don't even have to ask because you two look beautiful. Aww. But you always do. <laughs> it's true. Oh, you guys are very sweet. The spa was amazing. I feel like a new person, thanks to Belle. Aw, you don't have to keep thanking me. I uh, enjoyed it, too, and much more than I would have if I were by myself. So thanks for joining me. <laughs> are you two ready for breakfast? Because the waffles are fantastic. <laughs> yeah, actually, I'd like some juice, maybe a bagel. Well, Sweet. I'll have some waffles. I am starving. <laughs> You sure don't want the waffles? No. They're like that thick. They're amazing. <laughs> so you're not going to believe what else I did. What, honey? Well, I called Lexi. I found out what we had to do to set up an appointment. I think just to get the ball rolling, you're going to have to get some hormone shots at the beginning. Whatever. I don't care. I'm just so excited. I can barely stand it. Yeah, well, so am I. I'm thinking as soon as we're done with breakfast, we should probably check out and head back to town. I'm all for that. Okay. Me too, baby girl. Let's get this shoot on the road. Successful pregnancy achieved in 30.7% of all cycles. 83% of pregnancies resulted in a live birth. That's pretty good, huh? Wow, I still can't get over this. I just, I can't wait to talk to Lexi. Do you know there's even some research into the possibility of choosing your baby's sex? How about serious? that? <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. I don't think I would want to do that. I would just rather be surprised. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, but what would you want? I mean, if you could choose, you want a boy or a girl? Oh, wow. I, I'm not really sure. I guess one of each would be nice. <laughs> or two of each. Okay, yeah, but we're going to start with one, and then right. we'll go no, from there. What, what do you want, man? What do you want first, boy or girl? A boy, definitely. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I know what you're thinking. It's probably because of Zach, and that might be true, but anytime I pictured myself as a dad... It's always been with my son, doing things that I did with Zach, or wanted to do, like, you know, take him fishing or teach him about cars. Mm -hmm. I hear you, believe me. Uh, I wouldn't mind having a boy our second time around. Yeah, I'm, no. even if I can't teach him about fishing or cars. Or <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I can tell you, being around Claire, it also made me want to have a girl. Either way, however this works out, I'm just glad we're going to have a baby of our own. Amen to that. Oh, hi. Hi. Mrs. Lockhart, we didn't know you were there. Yeah. Good to see you, Neither huh? did I until we saw her at the spa. Hmm. Yeah, wow. Well, so what are you doing here? Oh, I'm just treating myself to a little spa day. <laughs> Sean Mimi told me the good news, and I never, ever thought I'd hear myself say this, but I can't wait to be a grandma. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Well, I think it would be great if you two had a boy. Who knows, you know, maybe he and Claire would end up dating. Oh, uh, <laughs> no, that could never happen. What would be so awful about your son ending up with my daughter? Well, Sean is Claire's cousin. Uh, that baby will be Claire's cousin. I mean, kissing cousins, but it was still. Yeah. Oh, God, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> you forget that Philip is Sean's uncle, and technically you're his aunt. Ew. Actually, I, I try to forget that as often as possible. Well, I guess if we do have a boy, they can settle on being friends as close as brother and sister. Mm.